everyone, welcome to my channel and in today's video I'll be demonstrating to you how to remove your artificial nails and I have had these for 7 days which is the suggested time you should wear them and I'm going to be using a product from KISS and it's their um, artificial nail remover all or one and it claims that it safely and gently removes full cover glue on nails, tips, gels, fabric wraps and most acrylic applications. And it also claims that it removes nails five times faster than acetone. And we are going to be using these simple three steps. I am first going to cut them, then I'm just going to dip them into this formula, which I'll be demonstrating. And then if you have any leftover glue on your nail, you can always buff it out. So as you can tell, I have already changed the angle of the camera so you get a better idea. And I'm going to be using this jumbo nail clip. And we are just going to cut the nail. then I'll be removing what I clipped off. So as you can tell, I have finished clipping them and now I'm going to dip them into this formula and I'm going to do my thumb separately since it usually takes a little bit longer for it to be removed and I'm going to dip them into the formula and move them around. There's some bristles in here which help the formula penetrate into your nail more quickly. And just in case you're wondering, the price of this product is $6.99 and you can check it out. You can check out their website at kissusa.com and you can also Look for it at um, your local drugstore. It's pretty neat. The first time that I used it, I was totally amazed at how fast it removed my artificial nails. It didn't take no more than five minutes. I also want to take the time right now to thank every one of my subscribers for your unconditional support. If you have any requests, feel free to let me know. And what else did I want to mention to you guys? Oh, to don't forget to give me a thumbs up if this video was helpful or if you learned something out of it as well. So I'm not going to have you here for the entire um, five minutes. But I will be back to demonstrate how to remove them. So one thing that I forgot to mention was that these bristles um, in this jar work to dissolve the artificial nails and eliminate the um, left uh, the the glue residue without damaging your natural nail bed or the surrounding cuticle area. So as you can tell, it has been dissolved the nail. It didn't take no more than five minutes. It's like magic. So these bristles help me remove that glue, that leftover glue. And if you have any more left, I would suggest that you get some a napkin, toilet paper, and just wipe it off. And it doesn't have a burning sensation, nothing of that sort. So the last nail, I'm going to place it where you just press the one nail, when you want to remove just one. So I let it sit in the formula for a couple of seconds. And then I just move it 
around the bristles. Which the thumb always gives me a harder time. See how fast it acts? It's starting to dissolve it. I had never seen a product of this sort, but if you're used to removing your nails with acetone, it just prevents you from spilling it somewhere, etc. because you just have this in one container and it just takes care of it all. You can be watching your TV, your favorite TV show, listening to music, and it's no longer a hassle to remove your artificial nails or being scared that you damage your natural nail. So you just move it and move it around the bristles. And as you can tell, my thumbnail has also been removed with this formula. So what I do if you have any leftover glue with the manicure or the nail filer that they provide you with, you can buff out the leftover product and the nail doesn't seem damaged at all. Doesn't look damaged at all. So I'm going to go ahead and give them a little bit of shape and I'm just going to go ahead now and remove my other hand and come back with both hands undone. Nothing glamorous, right? So now I'm back with my natural nails and this is what they look like after dipping them into that um, product and I filed them, buffed out any leftover glue and if you still had a hard time removing some of the um, extra glue, you can always use a little bit of acetone. And I'll be letting my nails rest for probably three days just to let them breathe a little bit before I paint them or um, apply some more artificial nails. And that is about it for this video. Thanks a lot for watching and if you haven't subscribed, make sure to do so. I really appreciate it. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up if this video was informative. Bye.